Well, I made it. Tide's been uh, low about a half hour. No waves, but there's some rollies. Stand by, I might have a target here. 10 all right the red ticket well I got three bottle caps and this look <laughs> God. well that thing does make a nice flute uh, scoop carrier look I got another one of these tickets that's number four I'm going the hell out of here as soon as I get back to my truck that is I think it works nice. That titanium looks good in that, don't it? That's right. Titanium. I got a, something I'm going to share with you when I get home on the top. I got a new top coming. This is a 75 degree top. I got a 90 degree top coming. That's nothing special, but what I'm going to show you what is special about it when I get home. Ah, Lee, I found a coin. Five meager cent, finally. One hour was too long where I was today. Dr. Beaver got a ring, a silver ring with a big blue stone in it. I just got a text with a picture of it. I'll, uh, I'll add it to the end of this tonight. I'm freezing to death. Stand by. Okay, the thing I was going to share with you is about the top. Well this is the 65 degree aluminum top. I got the 75 degree stainless steel top on now. And I told Tony that the fellow who makes these scoops and the tops that I'd like to have a 90 degree top. He said okay I'll get you one out make one up and get it out to you in the mail. And then I said well you know we need to come up with some kind of way for you to think about when the uh, fiberglass or when the wooden handle breaks off in the scoop right level with the top. A fast way to get it out other than drilling it out. Maybe you can split the pipe, you know, split it some kind of way and put it together or split it in the back. Or, you know what I'm getting at, split the pipe so it's kind of loose and then you put the pole or the fiberglass rod or the wood and you can tighten it up and it clamps around there. He said, okay, let me think about it. Well, it didn't take long, a half hour or so. He sent me another email. He said, I got it prop I got it figured out, no problem. Because I asked him, I said, you know, how are we going to get the scoop handle out when it breaks off? He said, it's simple. I said, okay. He said, you just take the top off of the scoop itself. I'll put a knockout hole right here half inch or three quarter you stick a rod in there or a big screwdriver and a hammer and you knock the you knock the pipe I mean the broke off piece right out like that God I said that's too easy so anyway when I get the 90 degree handle it's gonna have a hole right here to knock the broke off handle out now I've become very efficient at knocking at getting the wood out I have two drills that I use and then two paddle bits so I can get them out of there 
in about 15 minutes. Well, it used to take me 45 minutes sometimes to get them out of there, but I've done so many, I'm pretty, pretty good at it now. But this will make it very simple. Of course, when I get the stainless 75 degree top off, I'm going to drill a hole in it so I can knock the handle out if and when it breaks off. Pretty cool idea. This uh, removable top thing is pretty, pretty cool deal. Okay, I forgot to add that. See you later.